Let me get this straight, one student said. You're telling me that if I say something out loud, it's me saying it. But if I write the exact same thing on paper, it's somebody else, right? Yes, I said. And we're calling that fiction. The student pulled out his notebook, wrote something down, and handed me a sheet of paper that read, That is the stupidest fucking thing I ever heard in my life. They were a smart group. As Mr. Sedaris, I made it a point to type up a poorly spelled evaluation on each submitted story. I dispense such sage professional advice such as punctuation never hurt anyone or think verbs. For the most part, students either accepted or politely ignored my advice. Trouble arose only when authors used their stories to vindicate themselves against a great hurt or perceived injustice. This was just the case with a woman whom the admissions office would have labelled a returning student, meaning that her social life did not revolve around the cafeteria.